I've always had a real passion for science and grew up in a police family. So being able to combine the two was something that was absolutely fantastic for me. I have to admit, I absolutely loved studying it here. Um, when I came on my open, sort of the open day and I saw the campus and I saw the facilities and everything like that, uh, just it felt like home. Um, I met so many lovely people, everybody was so friendly. And when I was looking at the time, it was one of the top universities for forensic sciences. It was accredited. It just ticked all the boxes for me. It was absolutely fantastic. The best parts were sort of doing, having the ability to do everything, um, not just focusing on one particular subject. So I was learning about sort of the criminalistics, so being in the crime scene house, doing all those sort of things, um, and then could be immediately in the next lecture being in a practical session in the labs doing chemistry or DNA and that variety was great. It made me realise that it's not just one specific thing that you can do, there are so many things that you can learn and you can learn it here um, and have that support that you need. Because I had got such good um, practical experience by having work in the labs, it is something that sort of sets you above those other people that go for the same jobs. Uh, my employers were really impressed by that skill set that I had. I was able to not only tell them the theory behind DNA and what we do, but actually show them how we do it and sort of have that conversation, something that more often than not, most employers have to build up new people and freshly graduated people, but I sort of came as a ready-to-go package um, and that really sets you above the rest of the people. I am a forensic DNA analyst um, for LGC Forensics and I process uh, sort of samples that come in from police forces and from other customers that we get um, for forensic purposes. We sample exhibits, we then take them through the laboratory processes of extraction all the way through to capillary electrophoresis. Um, I also then analyse and interpret the data. So I look at profiles that we get and I sort of interpret that to see whether or not it's something that will provide um, very good intelligence to the police force. And if that is the case, it's something that could be loaded to the DNA database. And that way it sort of helps. So if that same person commits that same crime, it'll hit and we can help get that person off the streets. We can also help prove innocence as well. And that, to me, that's something that's very important. It's not just showing that guilty person's guilty, but also someone is actually can be innocent of a crime as well. It, it sounds um, quite, uh, cliche but I, I do love my job and there are some very long days and some very hard days but knowing that the impact that I have it's not just a sample in a tube that is some something that's impacted someone's life and that ability to be able to help that person makes it all worthwhile in the end. My highlights were sort of two things it was being in the lectures and learning the from people's experience we didn't just have sort of academic people, we've had people that have been there and, and done the work themselves and to learn from those people was a fantastic experience but also the sort of social side and sort of the friends that I made here, I still keep in contact with them, we still have meetups and it's been a good few years since we've all graduated and we're still very much a part of people's lives and I think that's a great experience for just general life, like you, you make friends here um, and it's just two great experiences.